When you visit Flagstaff, one of your first stops should be here, Lowell Observatory, where you can learn about the past while getting a peek into the future. Lowell was established in 1894, and through the years, there have been several noteworthy discoveries uh, noteworthy around the world, not just in these areas. The first evidence of the expanding universe was detected with this telescope right behind me. Pluto was discovered here in 1930. Um, and, but that's just the foundation of what's happening today because we're still a thriving research facility and have one of the most powerful telescopes in the world in the Lowell Discovery Telescope. There really is increasing interest in astrotourism. It's hard to look at our visitation numbers the last couple of years because of COVID. And you know, that's kind of messed up everything, but certainly pre-COVID, num our numbers kept going up and, and there's a lot of interest. And I think, you know, we spend so much time staring at, at you know, computers and iPads and phones and to be able to reconnect with the universe and just look up or look through telescopes and feel part of what's out there I think it's really captivating for people. I think Lowell is unique because we have this strong heritage of research, but it's not just historic, it's still going on. So we have cutting edge research going on. People can walk down the sidewalks here and run into one of our astronomers and chat with them. Phase one, was building what's called the Giovanni Open Deck Observatory. The building rolls back, you have six telescopes all ready to look at the night sky. It's like an instant star party every night. Phase two opens in 2024, and that's the Kemper and Ethel Marley Foundation Astronomy Discovery Center. And it's 40,000 square feet, three stories, and this isn't just Lowell Observatory or even Flagstaff. This is, this is gonna be a crown jewel for all of Arizona. We're open every day, except for a couple of major holidays and most nights. And so anytime you can come in, you know, you're traveling through town, you don't have to make reservations months ahead of time. You can just drop by anytime. 